The pursuit of continuous growth is an endless race. Nations are often recognized for their architectural wonder, be it the Lighthouse of Alexandria or the Egyptian pyramids. Throughout history, humans have constructed structures that are remembered for centuries. Merdeka 118 is one such architectural marvel. It isn't just an ordinary building, it stands as a testament to Malaysia's ambition, rising above challenges and standing tall, almost shoulder to shoulder with the world's tallest structures. It has 118 stories with the height of 678.9 meters, making it the second tallest structure in building globally, just a head shorter than Dubai iconic Burj Khalifa, which is 828 meters tall. The name Merdeka and its architectural design hold immense significance in Malaysian history, as they serve as a reminder of Tunku Abdul Rahman, iconic outstretched hand gesture, while fervently chanting, Merdeka, Merdeka! marking the proclamation of Malaysia's independence on August 31, 1957. The construction of Merdeka began in February 2016. Merdeka PNB 118 is being built on a site in the vicinity of the Merdeka Stadium in Kuala Lumpur. It's only 100 meters away from the stadium. Furthermore, the Merdeka Stadium is a historic site in the capital city of Malaysia because it was the site where the Declaration of Independence was made. The stadium also holds sporting events, celebrations and concerts. One of the most memorable events was the History World Tour held in October 1996, when the legendary Michael Jackson came to town with two concerts. These concerts collectively drew an audience of 110,000 people to the site. Also, in recent years, the stadium has hosted many other shows, featuring stars like Mariah Carey, Jennifer Lopez, Justin Bieber, and other stars of equal international repute. Upon the completion of Merdeka 118, it will join the ranks of two other iconic landmarks the Kale Tower and the Petronas Towers. Merdeka 118, previously known as Manara Warasun Merdeka, Kale 118 and PNB 118 is a super tall skyscraper in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. It's a staggering 118 stories. The architectural height of Merdeka 118 stands at 678.9 meters measured from the ground to the tip of its spire. This impressive height was officially unveiled on November 30, 2021. The top of the crown is estimated at about 570 meters above mean sea level, while the tower base rests at 55 meters above sea level. Without considering the spire, the tower's height above the ground is approximately 515 meters. The highest occupied floor is perched at a height of 485 meters above the ground. Merdeka 118 soars to an impressive height of over 2,220 feet above the capital of Malaysia. This megatol tower stands as a record-breaking skyscraper in Kuala Lumpur and all of Southeast Asia. It took more than $1 billion to build. The building's exterior features triangular glass panels that take inspiration from patterns commonly seen in traditional Malaysian arts and crafts. These panels not only serve an aesthetic purpose, but also symbolically represent the rich cultural diversity that defines the people of the country. The architectural design for this building was crafted by Fender Ketsalidis, a Melbourne-based firm renowned for their innovative creations, including the iconic Eureka Tower in Melbourne. The Merdeka Tower will encompass a vast 3.1 million square feet of floor space, promising a vibrant hub for various activities. At its core, Merdeka 118 offers top-grade office spaces spanning an impressive 83 floors from levels 8 to 96, with 1.7 million square feet dedicated to these spaces. It becomes a prestigious address for businesses and organizations, fostering a dynamic environment for productivity and innovation. Adding a touch of luxury to the tower is the 17-story Park Hyatt Hotel a first of its kind in Malaysia. Nestled from levels 98 to 112, this world-class hotel boasts 252 guest rooms, promising guests an opulent stay and exceptional hospitality services. For shopping enthusiasts, the 118 Mall awaits, a seven-story shopping center set to open its doors in 2024. This retail paradise will offer a diverse array of shopping and dining experiences creating a lively destination for both residents and visitors. 
One of the most exciting features of Merdeka 118 is the view at 118, an observation deck that ranks among the highest in Southeast Asia. Situated on levels 115, 116, and a mezzanine floor within level 116, this deck provides a breathtaking 360-degree view of Kuala Lumpur's urban landscape. Visitors will have the unique opportunity to witness the city from unparalleled heights, making it a must-visit attraction. To ensure convenience and accessibility, the tower also boasts six levels of underground parking, accommodating around 8,100 parking spaces. This thoughtful provision minimizes congestion in the surrounding areas, making it hassle-free for both visitors and tenants to access this incredible destination. The monumental Merdeka 118, a project owned by Permit Allen National Burhud PNB, is nearing completion and is poised to redefine the city's skyline. Tinku Dada Kabaziz Tinku Mahmood, the CEO of PNB Merdeka Ventures, the project's developer shared exciting updates on this remarkable endeavor. PNB, the Malaysian National Investment Authority, will occupy a significant portion of Merdeka 118, spanning 17 floors within the tower. The construction of this architectural marvel started in 2016, encompassing not only the construction of Merdeka 118, but also the restoration of the historic stadium Merdeka. However, the COVID-19 pandemic posed challenges causing a one-year delay in the project's completion. Tanku Abaziz emphasized that the development is now in its final stages, awaiting approvals from relevant authorities including the Fire and Rescue Department. Merdeka 118 is not only about grandeur but also about sustainability. As of August 2023, it has achieved an impressive 97.8% completion rate and is on track to become the first tower in Malaysia to attain a triple green platinum rating from international sustainability certifications. This commitment to sustainability is attracting the attention of international companies, seeking environmentally responsible and socially conscious buildings. As Merdeka 118 enters its final stages of development, it promises not only to redefine Kuala Lumpur's skyline, but also to serve as a symbol of Malaysia's commitment to progress and sustainability on the global stage. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe.